What's up guys? How's it going? Welcome to my first English video. I am sorry if my pronunciation isn't great or if I have grammatical mistakes. I'm gonna try to do my best anyways. I think it was finally time to tell you all the news from Raptor because this guy started to appear the same day I was going on a trip and until just now I could not show you what is new. So. If you want to make sure these screenshots are true, if you don't believe me or something, you have everything in this group's official Geometry Dash server. In fact, he's talking there every day, and sometimes he gets into boys' schools. There are lots of messages that I won't show you because I don't think they are really important, but anyway, in this video I will show you about 40 screenshots, all from the past weekend about the wars and all. And as I say, Raptop is very active in the server, so if you want to talk with him or whatever, you will have the opportunity to do so if you get to enter in this court's Geometry Dash server. Alright, let's get started. The most important announcement, you will probably know it already, is the removal of Raptop's games. Google has deleted almost everything, including World, Meltdown and Light, and he also thinks that Sub-Zero will be removed as well. But right now, they are all uploaded again. He thinks it's because when you go up to the tab, more games appear, you sub zero playing out for free, and it seems Google didn't like the way Rob did the advertisement about this own game, about the get it now, because they say you are falling because it leads you to download the other game. It doesn't let you top late right away, but Rob already fixed that. He added a Google Play button. I think this is just a nonsense, but well, it's not so nonsense when you see that this is making Rotop delay the sneak peek. But anyways, it's not so difficult, in my opinion, to just press the record button, record 30 seconds, stop recording, and unlock the video. You don't even have to edit it. But anyways, this is not important. The thing is, and I think I didn't say on the channel yet, that there's gonna be two new levels. He just did the same as with 2.0 update, but this time, thanks to Google, who removed his games, he just leaked it. In Meltdown's game files, you could see the level songs and there was Explorers and a level called Fiverr, whose song is from MDK, but he already denied this and said this was a fake he put into the game because he knew there would be people who would leak this. But it doesn't mean there's going to be only one level. The main cause for Fiverr not being a level is that he lies that we don't know the song for the first sneak peek until day premiere. He did this as well with Geometrical Dominator from Waterflame. He also insinuated the sneak peek would be out this month, and I wish it could be out before I was researched, the 28th of December. By the way, it's gonna be very fun in streaming. Of these two levels, one is gonna be insane and the other one will be a demon. Which one do you think it's gonna be the demon? Let me know in the comments. Let's get into the next point. The map. I don't know if this sounds familiar to you, I only talked about this once and Raptor did not say anything about it. Nobody knows what is this about. In my opinion, I think it's like a story mode using the new 2.2 platform mode. In fact, about the map, he shot screenshots that look like a map and it reminds me a lot to Geometry Dash World. I think it's gonna be similar. A dotted map where you progress when you complete a level and I think it's pretty funny because it breaks with what we are used to of completing a level with the cube having a constant speed. This is why Raptop says the platform mode is gonna be an experiment. If people like it, he will keep upgrading it adding enemies, sound effects, if not, he will just let it die. Maybe it will die like the map packs we already know. He even made drawings about the characters, concepts like the one I'm showing you on the screen right now. I find them pretty funny. Except Wave, Swing Copter and the Double Portal, every game mode will be available in platform mode. Even some of them will have some modifications, for example, the ship, which will stop being a ship from no one it will be a jetpack platforming as I say. I'm showing you the first concept of the jetpack in adventure mode. As I say, it's just a concept and we will probably see it more fancy in 2.2. Raptop also told us that if this goes on, if people like this, he has thing of his mind. Like for example, adding a special new game mode for adventure mode in 2.3. But whatever, when we say 2.3, I think we are talking about the year 2025. Because when we talk about future updates, we are talking about myths. Like when he says he's gonna be more active, gonna have more communication, uh, <laughs> no, I don't think so. 
At last but not least, I'm gonna put it in the map tab, Rocks up told us, forget about the map, the real question is, who is the king? And he just sent us a dragon of this, uh, what could it be, I don't understand, maybe the reincarnated Darkness, who nobody remembers, maybe it's related to the map and he's just trying to distract us, uh, what do you think, what do you think it is, let me know in the comments because this is the only thing that really breaks my mind. Let's keep on with the video. Now with the miscellaneous tab, Hertz, FPS and all of that, because everybody is interested in the fair play. Rotop says that as now on, physics will be the same in 60, 124 or 240 Hertz. Apart from, as you know, we can establish a determinate FPS quantity with our first software to be able to do this. In fact, for the one who have 144 Hertz or 240 Hertz, Raptor says that right now, between what we have now and what we are gonna have in 2.2, he feels no difference. So I suppose that's a very good point. But something I think is very important and it's something that some ones will like and some others not, is that the laggy GD died. Those lags you have where the game stops working for 30 or 40 frames, somebody will think this is nonsense. But for somebody like me, who's playing Artificial Ascent, uh, well... What Raptor made to erase this is to make a new buffer memory. This means that if you have lag like me as you saw in that video, those photograms that didn't work are gonna be saved and applied after that. Instead of happening what you just watched, the game will just be a little slower and after that it will work as fast as always. Then, we have things that are not as important as the others, but Raptor just thought about them. Like adding accessories to the different icons and he even tried to make an animated icon, but he thinks that if he makes this, all the other icons are gonna lose relevance, so he doesn't like it. That's why, as I'm showing on this screenshot, he said to add accessories to the icons. To make everything a little more fun, I don't know how it would be maybe a cap or something like Goldfit, I think it's better to the platformer. Another little detail is like a Discord icon, he's thinking about putting Discord profiles in the GD profiles, but he doesn't really know how to do it. Maybe with a name tag or a server, but anyways, I told you this, and we'll say what he does. Other details, for example, diamonds are gonna have more value in 2.2, not only to open shops, maybe to use them in another way. I think this is cool because you collect diamonds, you collect ops, but they are not useful at all. Only to unlock shops and buy stuff, but how many people will be in the game with millions of ops? There will be also more chests and more keys that will not be used all in this. For last, I put this at the end to see who watched the entire video. I will show you this screenshot which says that probably because of the game side, he won't add Meldom, Sub-Zero and World songs to the main game. But I want you to think, why he say that? Are not Meldom, Sub-Zero and World spin-offs of the game who are not related at all to the main game? I mean, to unlock things in 2.2, will we have to complete these games and back up the data in the main game? I hope you liked this video, it took me hours to speak English that fully, I think it's okay, let's see it's okay. If you have any suggestions, put them in the comments, and I think I told you everything, so I will say goodbye now. I am Guitar, and I wish you good night.